Why is this? Get ready! Metal Rush event. With the official rules and schedule, the first Method Rust POV race season starts just in a few days. Ooh, it's five days. Will take place over four days and feature a whole lot of bosses getting rushed down from scratch. Today we'll uh, take a look at the official rules for the event and the full schedule. But first, let's go over the inspiration for the Metal Dust Race. Nice. This is this is very relevant to uh, what we're reading right now. Uh, okay. The Metal Rush Race season one will start with the qualifier races, and from there, the top 35 qualifiers will duke it out in a series of races ranging in complexity, speed, and danger in order to rack up as many points as possible. With 11 separate boss rushes, each having its own place for 100 reward. Man, Tai Tai is gonna be rich, dude. And a total of uh, 42 plays it, uh, worth of crash prizes on the table. This should be quite the event to tune in for. I don't even remember, so, so you get, so that's 1100 from there, and then you then rank one get something, rank two and rank three. Right? Like overall. Just the winner winner of each race and then top uh, one, two, three, right? Or oh, like top three. Yeah. And the, the event will be streamed on a Metal Twitch channel and you can check full rules here. With the dog, Google Dog. In case you were wondering what the meme race are. They are just different and fun things that some of your favorite community members will be doing to lighten the mood and won't be included in the season standing. For example, on the first one, which should kick off around, you know, late after the race, after the race are done, Ziggy D, Amy, Cute Dog and MP in a default attack plus conversion trap 45 minute XP race. Yo. Why is it bad on the official list? Of races. That sounds fucking amazing. <laughs> Gosh. Schedule. Qual for Apple 25th. I think this is like... CST... Wait, wait. How much is CST past GMT? I don't remember. This is like Central European Summertime, right? So this is like... Is this plus 2 or plus 1 GMT? Okay, so that's like 4 p.m. for me, which is a really, really good t starting time. Because I'm I'm plus 3 to GMT right now. Pre-show, Softcore Act 5, Kitawa, with 2 arc cutoff. It's uh, getting Miss Wedding. Oh, so 5 p.m. for me, that's nice. I, I just finished one run and it was one, and a, 1 hour 31 minutes or something like that. Bonk. And that's... And I need to, not only I need to get, you know, under the cutoff, I also need to actually be in the top 35. And then the meme race. Pre-show. And then on the second day, so the actual race season, when it starts. Uh, Pre-show, hardcore wall kill. Hardcore piety kill in Lunaris 2. I wonder if this is gonna be a shadow or witch run. I feel like this is gonna be a witch run just because you get uh, you get to the uh, whatever the fuck they're called the 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 movement speed nodes, the dual wield nodes, and then we get a Malakai and Act Five Kitala. This is a this is a pumped up day, dude. With a lot of stuff. I just realized this should have been Mervale, Val, Domino. No, I don't think it's fine. It's fine. I was like, I was like looking. That's the bo act, act boss. That's an act boss. That's an act boss. And finally, isn't why they should have been Dominus, dude. But I guess it's uh, for the time, you know. 
it's an, the next extra 10 or 15 or something minutes. And uh, this is already a long day. And then the week after. Pre-show, Hardcore Dominus. Hardcore 90 minute XP. Dude, this race brings me back. Brings me back to the uh, good old times of just races that had time and then uh, you just XP. And then Act 5 Kitala. I wonder, this is probably going to be... This is probably going to be Docs. No, way, 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 way. No, the, no, no, no. This is this is going to be Chamber of Innocence farm. Yeah, this is this is absolutely going to be Act 5 Innocence farming. Yeah. I wonder if this I wonder if if the winner in this is going to be Orb of Storm with Prolif or is it going to be a uh, Storm brand? It's probably one of those. It's either Storm brand or Orb of Storm with Prolif. I mean, obviously both of them use Prolif, but Hmm. Interestingly, I wonder. I wonder if. I wonder if going for an ascendancy is good for this, because if you're going for an ascendancy, you'd get like fucking crazy AOE on elementalist. But you're probably way too behind in XP when you get to farm. I don't know. That's, an in that's interesting. And then the last day. Pre-show, Brutus Burst, Murwell Bursts. Oof. I think we're gonna be we're gonna be blasting Brutus and Murwell Bursts on the on the day before the race starts like crazy. Oh, Malakai and Izaro kill. A BOB for my trickster, yes, exclamation mark build and then click on the BOB for the or like take the BOB for the ED. It'll, it'll be a really fun event with some top players participating with anyone in the community being able to join as well. So make sure to tune in, starting with qualifiers this Saturday. You can also check out the method at Twitter for updates and the latest news about event and everything method. Yes. It's gonna be, uh, gonna be fun, boys. I really hope I qualify. I'm gonna be so sad if I don't, but it's, th it's top 35. Um, so there's, there's a, there is actually a possibility that I don't qualify. It's gonna be, it's gonna be yikes, but we'll see. Uh, at least with the current time, with the 131 that I did earlier today, it's gonna be rough. But if I can drop another five, ten minutes from that, which should be doable, then I, then I'm thinking good. I still have like five days for it anyways. The issue with that is that if I'm literally just practicing for the qualifier alone uh, for this, then I don't really have much time to prepare for these. But obviously, if I have a good Act Five time, then then this is good, right? So I'm practicing for the Act Five Act Five Kitava. But all of these, all of the other three races have a different setup. You're you're gonna be a different level at the end, like. For example, on a race where you're going for Act 5 Kitava, you're going to be much higher level fighting Malakai than you are in an actual Malakai kill race. Because you just want to get to Malakai and kill him, right? You're going to be like few levels lower than you would be on Act 5 Kitava. So there's like an entirely different like leveling strat for it. Yep. Yeah. It's going to be fun. Even if I fail miserably. And now, boys.